Great, okay, so sure, much. no problem. If you need to renew your license plate, you might run into Holly Phillips. She processes licenses and vehicle titles for Johnson County's Motor Vehicles Office. Holly is part of a major cultural shift in Johnson County government. We want to become a values-based organization um, where we believe that all of our employees, regardless of where they sit in our organization, can exercise leadership. Johnson County's Human Resources team has been taking a leading role in bringing this change about. Thanks to HR's leadership, an environment has been created that allows Holly to fully contribute on the employee performance management team. Holly realizes she doesn't need to be a manager to contribute, and she's lending her voice to decisions that will affect the county's entire workforce, which is about 4,000 people. This group is revamping the county's employee review process. In these meetings, managers and frontline employees take part as equal partners. You'll see people who will sit back and listen and process. Um, some people won't speak until they feel that they have articulated what they want to say. Um, but everybody gets a turn. Everybody gets to be heard. The shift in Johnson County's culture goes back to 2011. That's when county management committed the organization to learning and implementing the principles of high-performing organizations. Everybody in this organization can contribute and is expected to contribute. One of the portions of our uh, foundational documents is our leadership philosophy. And one of those statements basically says that leadership in this organization is the responsibility of all. Johnson County leaders went to work spelling out the organization's foundational values. They're summed up in the pillars of performance. In a high performing organization, a great deal is placed on trust. And we do trust each other to do the right thing for the right reasons and for the public good. The human resources team has taken a leading role in making sure all employees learn about the pillars of performance and understand the cultural shift that's taking place. That's the goal of LEAP training. It stands for Leadership Empowers All People. It's given to every new employee who walks through the door. One of the key pieces that we teach comes from the Athenian Oath, and which basically boils down to we do want to leave this community better than we found it. And we need every employee to understand that, to understand that why, so that then when they go out and do their jobs, that they can keep that in mind and understand who we are, who we want to be, and who we're continuously striving to become. The LEAP training has led to positive change throughout the organization. New ideas generated by employees are being put into action. Rick Gelbach is a house inspector and Richelle Popivis a senior administrative assistant in the Department of Human Services. They had an idea to put the contact information of other social service agencies on the back of business cards. When I see that somebody has a great idea, my role in that is to empower them and encourage them to do that. So it, it truly was a no-brainer. It's like, yeah, run with it, go do it. Rick hands them out everywhere he goes. It's a way for him to help clients above and beyond just doing house inspections. Human Resources is working on new ways to reward value-driven accomplishments like this. We are looking at how we do our jobs from a behavioral and operational standpoint. The culture shift in Johnson County has also led to many employees rising to their full potential. Ashley Tedder started out as a vocational specialist at Johnson County Mental Health. After she became a certified strengths coach outside of work in the Strengths Finder program, she was invited to try it with Johnson County employees. Her talent proved so valuable that her job was completely revamped. She now matches people to their strengths full time. Human Resources is taking a leading role in employee engagement, hoping to pave the way for more stories like this. Engagement helps us to make sure that everyone is able to contribute their best in our organization. It helps to contribute to great results. Um, and a lot of what we survey in the engagement survey lines up perfectly with our high performance organizational focuses and our pillars of performance. You can find success stories from LEAP training and the pillars of performance just about everywhere in Johnson County government. From MEDAC paramedics who have their own hiring group and choose their own new crew members, to health and environment workers who came up with a way to recycle unwanted paint. The Human Resources Department is continuing to lead the way in the cultural change that's making Johnson County a different kind of government, a place where every employee matters and shared values provide the foundation for everything they do.